Welcome back. We're going to get eaten by bears. Yay! The first thing we see at the campsite when we get here is to watch out for black bears because they've been visiting. Wow, the mosquitoes are really bad right here right now. Anyways, we are up north. We're at Temperance River Campground. We're camping here tonight, and then we're going to head further north tomorrow and go up to C.R. Mangi State Park and camp up there. We're gonna get some hiking in. There's not gonna be a whole lot of talking. We'll kind of talk later on tonight when we're sitting by the campfire, making dinner, everything like that. Um, mainly because I'm getting over some crazy sickness that I don't know what it was, but it kicked my ass completely. So I'm hoping being out in nature here helps solve that a little bit and uh, makes me feel a little bit better. But either way, we're gonna get some, some nature time in, get some bug spray on, set this tent up, and see you guys in a minute. Guys, this is gonna be cold. That is a cool rock. This is gonna be wickedly cold. Yeah, that's all I can handle. <laughs> oh, I did start getting used to it though. It's the, the feet for me. Yeah. I'm gonna try something. <sighs> See, like when you get down, it's not too bad. Once you breathe, you can feel it go through you. It's not that bad. My ankles. My ankles do this for me. You're not much of a walrus. <laughs> all right, so. We found our second spot to dip in. It's that pool that we were at earlier. Crystal clear in here. I mean, absolutely crystal clear. It's calm, it's cold, and I'm definitely gonna try to stick this one out a little bit longer. It already feels warmer. Yeah. Your steps are there, my steps are here. It's not any fucking warmer. You goddamn liar. <sighs> A lot more controllable. Oh. 
Oh, this is cold. My nipples are hard. I don't know if I can do much longer here. Woo! That's all daddy's got. Because my hands are going a little bit numb. Yeah. <laughs> Can't do it much more. Well, that was definitely cold. Uh, warming up now. We did a couple of dips in here. And it was cold. It was really cold. There was, there was some moments there where I... <laughs> just like I was ready to get out, but we stuck it out. Forbes stuck it out really well in there, and uh, well insulated. Yeah, it was cold. It was cold. Like I said, the water's about 44 degrees right now. Um, colder in some spots, warmer in other spots. That pool might have been closer to 50, somewhere in there. But either way, I mean, I tell you, you think 50 degrees is warm? Go turn your shower all the way cold and get in there. That's about 60. So it gets cold. It's really cold. But we're gonna warm up, head back to camp, light a fire, and watch like a movie or something. We'll figure this out. We'll see you guys later. Well, last night wasn't bad. Got a little wet, but breakfast is done. Ooh boy. A little corned beef hash and eggs over the fire. Yeah. And it rained on us this morning already making breakfast. So we're gonna eat breakfast, pack all of our junk up, move on to the next site. We made it to CR Mangy. We got ourselves all set up. Barbara's already broke his cot and his nature farting out here. It's kind of nice. Uh, we've got absolutely no cell phone service, no internet service, nothing like that. So it's just kind of like a actual camping trip. And it's it's a lot chillier up here today than it was yesterday. Um, so I don't think we're gonna dip in the lake today, but we're yeah. gonna go hike up to Devil's Kettle and see what's going on up there. Maybe hike further. We haven't really decided yet. Kind of see how it goes. I don't even know where it is. I think the trail's down there, but I'm not 100% sure. So we'll switch over to the GoPro and we'll go hiking right now.
were packed up. It was a, uh, I would say it was a pretty successful camping hiking trip. Things went really good. Um, we didn't film anything when we got back from the hike yesterday. Like I said, this isn't going to be a whole lot of talking on this one. It's more or less just the B-roll and the footage and the scenery. I'm getting over that sickness. Absolutely kicked my ass, completely destroyed me, but I'm glad I got out, got it done, because it was worth it. It's beautiful out here. We're letting the fire burn down a little bit. Literally got everything packed. We got to throw garbage away and get out of here. So we're going to make the four four hour drive home and we'll see you guys on the next video. Right? Yeah.